You're really happy. Why do we always complain, get upset, and suffer, because of the unfulfilled things in life? We always see our difficulties, and always think that we are the poorest, the most pitiable in every situation. We always uphold our individualism, thinking that we are inferior to this and that, so we are not equal to others, and not as happy as other people. We always feel that life is too unfair. But have you ever sat down and looked at yourself? Do you know you are very lucky and happier than so many people on this earth? If you have food to eat, clothes to wear, a roof to stay in, even if it's a rented room, you are richer than at least 1.2 billion people in the world. If you have money to spend in your wallet, money to give to the poor, and some money in the bank, you are among the 4.8 billion richest people in the world, and happier than 2.2 billion others. If you wake up feeling a little better this morning than yesterday, you're luckier than at least the 1.2 million people, who won't last this week. If you have never experienced the dangers of war, the loneliness of prison, the pain of torture, or the struggle of hunger, you are happier than the 600 million people in this world, who are suffering from war, imprisonment, torture, or hunger, according to the Christ's Human Rights Report. If your parents are still living together and are happy together, and you too, then your case is not much compared to the rest of the world. If you can still freely visit monasteries, temples, or shrines according to your religious beliefs, without fear of harassment, persecution, torture, or loss of life, you are luckier than many people on this earth. If you are stuck in traffic and traffic jams, do not despair. There are many people in this world, driving is an unrealized dream for them. If you feel study very boring, think of the people who never went to school. If you are sad because another weekend is ending, think of the women in the harsh working environment, having to work 12 hours a day, seven days a week to raise children. If you feel lost, ask yourself what life is, and what the purpose is. Think of the sick, who know in advance how long they will not live, and have no chance to question themselves. If you feel terrible about being the victim of cruel jokes, the pettiness of other people, remember, that's nothing, because it's worse when you can be those people. Know how to look optimistically at seemingly negative problems, and constantly improve yourself to become better, you will see how beautiful this life is. And finally, if you read this message, you are happier than 0-2 billion people in this world, who can't read anything. Then cherish what is in your arms, because many people in this world are dreaming of being like you.